All right, I'm Max Becker, I'm running for Vice President, and um, for all the freshmen in the room, just want you to be honest with me for a second, can you raise your hand if you know 50 kids on campus by first and last name? You guys are killing me. Albert, put your hand up. I know that. <laughs> <laughs> How many of you guys have 50 kids' phone numbers? All right. Leave, come on. <laughs> um, I wouldn't have been able to raise my hands for either of those questions. Um, and it's not because I'm incapable of making friends or that I'm an introvert or anything. It's just that we've been here for like three and a half weeks. Um, and it's impossible to be on a first name basis with everyone in campus, so I'm not gonna stand here and pretend to know what each and every one of you guys want. Um, I'm running for vice president in the hopes that all of you guys will share your hopes and your improvements that you want around campus. Um, and uh, I wanna be, like Josh said, friends with all of you. Um, so as I'm writing this speech, um, I'm laying in my bed four in the morning yesterday. Um, so like the majority of you guys, I procrastinate every once in a while um, or for every single assignment I've ever got. Um, the last thing that I wanna do is walk up on this podium and come off as pretentious and snooty, although the suit and the watch probably don't help with the whole not looking like a douche thing. Um, I came to Con excited to get away from all the crap that high school from all the crap from high school, just like most of you sitting in front of me. And you know, I did my fair share of captaining sports and founding clubs and leadership on campus, but I wouldn't want someone to come up here and read me a resume from high school. Um, I'm looking forward to excelling here at Con, as most of you are, I'm sure. And I'm not just talking about academics. These are supposed to be the best four years of our lives, and we have the opportunity right now to make our college experience everything we wanted and more. I love the whole self-governance vibe we've got going on at Con, and I want to be part of the process that brings the power to the people. I want to create an atmosphere, atmosphere where no one is trying to be someone that they're not, and no one is trying to fit in somewhere that they won't. One of the reasons I came to Con was because of how open and inviting it felt. The student body didn't judge each other, and no one seemed to be pressuring anyone into anything that they didn't want to do. I'm looking to promote this philosophy as Vice President, and make sure that your suggestions are heard to preserve and develop the very principles that drew you all to Con in the first place. So during this election, you guys are going to be making an investment in the future of our class. Because you know, it's really difficult to unseat an incumbent, and I'm going to guess that every upperclassman on SGA has held a spot in student government before. So I want you guys to think long and hard about who you want to represent your class for possibly the next four years. These are the people that you will come to with your problems, and they will be expected to do something about them. I know that I will live up to these expectations and be one of those people for the class of 2018. As Chuck Heleniak, however you say that, author of Fight Club said, find joy in everything you choose to do. Every job, relationship, home, it's your responsibility to love it or change it. I want that responsibility and leadership that comes with being vice president of our class to make this home that we love, to make this the home that we love for the next four years and the rest of our lives.